With Workbench, you can create new columns in your data using a calculated field transformation. This happens as your data is brought into your Domo instance, so your dataset is card ready without requiring additional transforms in Domo. To create a calculated field, we'll select the job that we want to apply the transform to in Workbench. In this example, we have a job named Customer Data. Clicking over to the Schema tab, we have a first name and a last name column that we want to combine into a column titled Full Name. To add a transform, navigate to the Configure tab, open up the Transform section, and click the drop down next to Add a Transform. Select the transform that we want, in our example that's Calculated Field Transform, and click the Add button. This opens a modal used to create the calculated field. We'll begin by giving the new column a name. In this case, full name. If we click on the Available Functions tab, we are provided with a list of functions that we can use in our calculated field. They are broken down by category. We have date and time, logical, math and trig, statistical, and text. Each function has a description that displays if we hover over it and an example of the formatting. In our example, we want to use the concatenate option, joining our two text columns into a single item. If we double click, it will fill in the text box with the function. We'll remove any of the text after our open parentheses and begin filling in the function with the information that we want. If we navigate to the Available Columns tab and double click on the column name, Workbench will add it to our calculation. Now, we want to add a space between the column inputs, so we'll type in a comma double quote, space, double quote, and then another comma. Finally, we'll double click the last name column and add a closing parenthesis. After clicking Apply, we can preview the transform by clicking this button. In the data preview, we can see that the full name column has been created using the data from the first name and last name columns. If we need to edit the transformation, we can always go back to the Configure tab, select our transform, and edit it by clicking the pencil icon. This reopens the modal where we can make any changes that we need to and then click Apply. Once happy with the transform, we can save our changes to the job and it will be applied the next time it's run and the data is pushed into Domo. Streamline your data transformation by creating your calculated fields as the data is being brought into your Domo instance with Workbench's calculated field transforms.